everyone hello my wonderful precious awesomely awesome beautiful people of the most high god good morning good afternoon good evening guys how are we all doing today i'm bringing you greetings and it's in the name of the father son and of the holy ghost let the peace of my father the peace that surpasses every human understanding be your portion and my portion in the mighty name of jesus amen to all my returning amazing subscribers you guys are simply the best what could i have done without you without you there is no us and that is the truth and to everyone that has not subscribed to this channel and you do come across us on youtube can you please hit the red subscription button and the notification bell so you get notified when we do upload new videos i'm juliana of this juliana tv in this channel we talk about god charity love life relationships and all health related matters so guys hop on board join us and let's do this together today i am bringing us our daily nuggets and i am going to read from the book of third john 1 verse 2 and it says beloved i wish above all things that thou may prosper and be in health even as thou so prospered yes child of the most high god this right here the father is telling us that even as our soul prospers as we seek to know him more that as we grow spiritually that we should work hand in hand also as to maintain our health so that when we are growing spiritually we are also growing in health that we may prosper yes and be in good health so that in all these three things should work together these three elements which includes prosperity which includes good health which includes spiritual growth that all three of them as we are doing one we should also be doing the other so we prosper spiritually we prosper physically and we prosper financially this is what this verse of the bible is telling us that even as we seek to know god more that we should not neglect our health neither should we neglect the financial aspect of our life that the bible is telling us that above all things that we should prosper in every area of our life yeah some of us we cannot try to balance it but then we find out that we are leaning towards one instead of the other and so we are seeking to to perfect our spiritual life perfect our spiritual growth perfect our soul you know knowing god respecting god walking by the precepts of god and then we begin to neglect our health that sometimes we can fast and fast and fast and we neglect the side effects of it that is also good to fast but you got to check your health condition too for some people that are really really sick with ulcers you know you cannot fast a whole week of you know no food no water so you can also fast but break your fat so that it does not aggravate your disease condition this is what the bible is telling us right here that also we cannot say we are praying that heaven will descend from god will descend from heaven to come and prosper us without us working hard towards prosperity yes because the bible even says that a lazy man should not eat so even as you are fasting and praying you know jumping around praising god doing everything that you are doing to move the hand of god that you should also in other words do something that the father will will, will leverage on to bless you child of the most high god that we cannot lack in area, any area of these things because we need one of every one of them to be able to prosper and be in good health we need every one of them to be able to prosper as our soul prosper we need every one of them to prosper even as our finances prosper a child of god we cannot neglect every aspect of this of this bible verse of this of this of this spiritual growth of this physical growth of this financial growth because they all work hand in hand yes so behold i wish that all things 
above all things that you prosper and be in good health as your soul prospered so we are praying to the god of heaven and earth that as we seek to know you more father help us also to know that we have to be in good health even to worship you because a sick man really cannot praise god that much because his strength is limited yes if you have something like asthma whatever and you praising god yeah you get short of breath then you have to catch your breath but if you don't have those things you can praise god you know endlessly so if you are hungry well you cannot praise they say that a hungry man is an angry man a hungry man will not have all that strength to praise god but when you are very very full and in good health child of god you can praise god all day all night yes so let us prosper spiritually physically mentally and otherwise yes and let the god of heaven help us to realize that all these things will work it together the bible says that all things will work together for those that trust god for those that believe in god for those that know the god that they serve so let all this work together child of the most high god for us the father wishes that we prosper because the bible tells us that the poor is is, is a servant to the rich and the father is we serve is the god of all wealth he wants all of us to prosper for child of god as you are a believer the father wants you to prosper he wants you to be elevated he wants you you know to move to move forward in life child of god so we have to ask the father to help us to balance this life balance this thing together so that we will prosper and be in good health and also as our soul prosper that all things will work together and not missing or lacking in one or the other area may the name of the god of jacob bless us even as we seek to know him more to serve him more to love him more even as we endeavor to make sure that we prosper both spiritually physically and otherwise in the mighty name of jesus amen thank you guys god will surely bless you in jesus name may the name of the god of my father the god of abraham isaac and jacob may he defend you may he speak for you yes in the name of jesus as you need help may help us arise to help you child of the most high god may you never lack help may strangers from nowhere be your helper when the time comes for it in the name of jesus you are blessed let the light of god continue to shine upon you your going out is blessed your coming in is blessed your children the works of your hand everything about you child of god is blessed let the name of my father defend you both now and forever in the name of jesus stay covered stay protected under the shadow of his wings in jesus mighty name we have prayed amen and amen i juliana i am signing out right this very moment remember you have to love god serve god you got to bless humanity faith hope and love the greatest of them all is love for love covers multitudes and multitudes and multitudes of sin oh yes so child of god learn to love okay learn to share learn to give learn to care for others and may jehovah have a mercy on you on me and all of us in jesus name amen i love you but jesus love you best so stay covered under the shadow of his wings be kind to yourself and be kind to everybody that you come across because you never know who is an angel in human form okay all right i'll see you guys on my next upload do have for yourself a lovely beautiful day bye bye Yeah.